And welcome back to episode four of Straight Out of Blender. I'm your host, Ken Fletcher. Um, this is a show, a Blender related show, but also art related show uh, where I give you links or show you things that I've come across that uh, from there that is related to Blender. And um, you can, I leave all the links in, uh, in the show notes below the video. Uh, Make sure you check that out. If you haven't already, um, I would really pr appreciate um, if you hit that subscribe button and follow me on Twitter and uh, give us a thumbs up, thumbs down, and leave your comments below. Uh, but without further ado, let's get straight to it. First up, we have um, graphic call. Now, if you're now if you're to in the you know really deep into the Blender community you're probably familiar with this website. Um, if you're not, um, this is uh, graphicall.org. And I guess it's just not, it's not only uh, Blender, um, but let's just for, for the sake of this video, <clears throat> um, there's other programs like uh, GIMP, but this is basically, basically a website um, where you can download um, Blender uh, builds, builds that are are currently uh being built with uh, new features so whatever the the next version of blender that's being currently worked on um as you can see um they post um they post uh current uh current development builds uh, so as you can see at the point of this video 2.8 blender 2.8 is in the development right now and as you can see, it's uh, you can download uh, the builds. Like for example, this is the Dis Cycles Disney uh, shader. Uh, uh, what do you call it? Physically based shader uh, development. And <clears throat> as you can see, I guess you can click this over here. This is the Windows and download um, the current build right now. So uh, next up. Um, again, that link is going to be in the description, or you can just type that in yourself, graphicall.org. Um, next up, we have, um, this is just something I came across, not, not, um, <clears throat> excuse me, it's not too, uh, not too amazing, but um, I thought it was kind of cool. This is the Garden uh, Asset Pack, and as you can see, it just has uh, different assets, uh, mostly grass and vegetation stuff or I guess stuff that will go in the back of your yard and stuff like that so I thought that was kind of cool uh, again the link is in the description next up uh, this is on blend swap um, as you probably already know I have um, I love modeling cars and I came across this on blend swap and this just seems look like this looks like a uh, um, extremely detailed uh, car rig of a Mercedes, Mercedes-Benz uh, W124-300, 1992. Yeah. Yeah, that just looks crazy. So, um, whoops. Right, so in this video, I'm gonna give you an overview. Uh, check this out. Again, the link is in the description. Uh, next up, we have um, a YouTube channel, DMS. Um, I came across this. This is a time lapse of uh, the modeling, the texturing, and rendering of a, uh, I guess, an oil lamp. For some reason, there's only 209 views, and he only, or, or she only has. 43 subscribers so let's just help this guy out very very talented uh, artist nice work cool stuff let's um as you can see there's other stuff uh again uh the link is in the description up up next we have uh, What's this creative station? Another channel I came across. Um, this is just a dessert video.
very cool stuff. Uh, check this out again. It looks like he's verified, so. Very cool stuff. Um, next up, let's see. We have Daredevil. Came across, I came across this as well. Very cool stuff. I'm not even going to pronounce, pronounce his first name. I think his last name is pronounced Saeed. Uh, very cool uh, blender and ZBrush related uh, stuff. Mo uh, I think I guess it was modeled in ZBrush and rendered in Blender. Let's check out. I guess some of his other stuff. Uh, but uh, you can check that out on your own. Next up, we have uh, Veer Lodhi. Hi, Lodhi. Um, Uh, this is not blender related, but it's 3d came across this his YouTube channel Again the link is in, in the description uh, just some very cool uh, 3d studio max um, Stuff But uh, next up I guess is our our last blender related um, content or or link. Uh, this is the filmic blender. Again, if you're in the in if you're in the blender community like deep, you probably heard of this. This basically, I'm not gonna go in really deep into it. I'm just keep it real short and dumb it down. Uh, this um, there's a plugin. For Blender, that would this plugin or or whatever would just make your um, would just make your 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 renderings look better or more realistic. Um, uh, check out this video. There's probably other videos uh, that I know. Well, there's other videos out there that show you how to uh, install this, but uh, you could check out that video yourself. Here's another artist. This is not Blender. I believe this is this is Moto, and again, this artist. Uh, I believe the last show uh, I showed an artist what he does. Uh, Jeremy, uh, I'm not going to say that's his last name. Jeremy, he does. I guess he'll model something in 3D and import it into uh, Photoshop and paint over it and matte paint it, which is really cool. That should give you some ideas. Uh, check out his, to, excuse me, check out his uh, channel. And um, the link is in the description. Next up, we have, um, let's see, another Substance Painter YouTube channel, Blackheart Films. I believe this is the first. I think that they might uh, have. I believe this is the first video that I came across that I saw. It's um, hot creating a highway in Substance Painter. Uh, very cool stuff. Check that out. Let's see. And finally, but not least, um, this YouTube channel. It's um, it's called uh, On Air, and it's ba most of the most of the videos on this channel. Um, it. Um, uh, warning, uh, this may not, this may not be work safe. This is, uh, basically a YouTube channel. Um, most, most of the videos on this YouTube channel does have nudity on it. Um, Croquis Cafe drawing tips are made possible. Uh, and it's just drawing tips and on how to become a better, better illustration. Uh, this is basically, it's kind of weird. It's kind of, it's like a figure drawing channel. Uh, and I mean, I went to art school. If you if you're not familiar in art school, what they'll have, you know, they'll have a nude model come up on a stage or a platform, and you would just do gesture drawings for a little bit, and um, for one minute or two minute or maybe ten minute gesture drawings, and um, you would just 
do that just for practice. And on this YouTube channel, there's a lot of there's a lot of gesture drawing videos. Basically, a nude model, um, nude models where you you know you would just do, I guess, a gesture drawing digitally. And some of the videos they uh, they rotate. The model rotates around, um, which I thought was a really cool idea, um, pre a pretty neat idea. Um, again, this is not work safe. There is nudity um, in these videos, but um, they don't get flagged because, you know, obviously it's art. So uh, make sure um, you check out this video very, uh, excuse me, check out this channel on air. Very cool site for what it does. Um, and I guess that's pretty much it for this, um, episode of straight out of blender. If you haven't already hit that subscribe button, when you hit that subscribe button like this, you will hit also as well, hit this, uh, just bell and hit send me all notifications for this channel. So whenever I do the next, uh, straight out of blender, um, episode five or episode, whatever, you can get that update. So I'll check you guys out later. Thanks a lot for checking out the video and take care.